channel. So today's look is as the. <laughs> okay, let's do this again. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today's look is on this dramatic glam look that I created. Um, I've been seeing a lot of like smoky eyes with glitter on them, so I wanted to recreate something like that. It is my go-to look. Like if I'm in a hurry and I want to just put on some makeup but I want to look good, this is what I usually do. Mine is like the dramatic lashes and I usually don't put on glitter, I'll just put on eyeliner. But this look is really easy to do um, and I only use three brushes, so that is a plus. I hope you guys enjoy and if you want to see how I got this look then just keep watching. So since this is a game talk. So since this is a smoky eye, I'm gonna do my eyes first and then I'll do the rest of my face. So to prime, I'm using Maybelline's Master Conceal and I'm just gonna put that all over my lids. Transition color, I'm going in with the uh, Anastasia. Tamanna palette with this brown shade right here. It's called Bangle. And I'm just going to put that above my crease. So you first want to start in your crease and then as you start to blend you want to take it higher to the brow bone. Just to make sure that everything we put on after blends in smoothly. I'm going to go in with the Morphe brushes palette. Um, this is the one that Jaclyn Hill created. And I'm going in with this shade right here. It's like a really warm brown color. And I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. Up to my crease. So when I'm in a hurry and I want a dramatic look but I don't have enough time, this is what I usually go for. Just because working with browns are much easier than working with blacks. I'm gonna go in with this darker brown color right here and I'm going to place that on top of the light color I just put on. Make sure you leave the inner corner bare because we're going to go in with some highlight and highlight that. Go back in with your blending brush and I'm just going to pick up this brown right here and blend everything together. I'm also going to use the same brush. This is a Real Techniques brush by the way. And I'm going to go on with the color chocolate and I'm going to place this pretty close to my lash line just to add some darkness. So now that my lids are done, I want to apply some eyeliner. I'm using the Inglot Gel Liner number 77. <laughs> in with this glitter. This is from NYX and I'm gonna put that over it. So today I'm using the Dream Velvet um, Soft Matte Hydrating Foundation by Maybelline. This is I think my second or third time using it. I'm actually really enjoying this stuff. Then I'm going in with my Real Technique sponge and I'm just going to blend that out. So I know I look like a freaking ghost right now, but I matched the color with my neck and I am pretty pale. Okay, so now that we look like a ghost, I'm going to go in with a concealer. I'm going with the Maybelline Master Conceal and I'm just going to put that under my eyes. Blend it out. Today we're gonna bake our face. I always bake my face most of the time. Just because I'm oily and I feel like I have to. eyebrows are done. I'm gonna go ahead and take this big brush and I'm just gonna dust away that powder from my face. So 
the contour, I'm going in with the Shade and Light Palette by Kat Von D, and I'm picking up this middle shade right here. And I'm just gonna contour. My face is more on the rounder side, so what I like to do to make it a little bit thinner is I connect my contour from my hairline down to my cheekbones and then down to my jawline. Just because it like recedes everything, so it makes it look smaller. So there you can see the difference from this side and this side. Like this just looks more pushed in, this is like bamboo. No, I'm just kidding, it's not that. Blush, I'm going in with Milani's Baked Blush in Rose Dioro. That's just fun. And I'm just gonna put that above my contour. Any black liner, and I'm gonna line my waterline with that. Let's go in with any definer brush and back with that brown shade and just pack that close to your lash line. To make sure that we don't have this harsh line right here, I'm just going to go back in with Bangle and I'm just going to buff that whole thing out. I'm going to go in with some falsies. These are the biggest name ones. I think they're called Grand Glamour or something like that. Glamour or something like that. I'll put it down below. I'm going to line my lips with this Jordana pencil and Cabernet. That I'm gonna go in with this ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in Stingray. To finish, I'm gonna take MAC Soft and Gentle. I'm gonna highlight the tops of my cheekbones. I'm gonna take this and put it in my inner corner. I'm so blind every time I freaking try to focus. I have to wear my glasses and focus. But here's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to leave a comment down below, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye. The cocaine. Ah. Say hi. Hi. This is my little baby sister. She's so cute. It's so funny, usually people like bring in their pets or something like that and I'm here like bringing in my child like, hey, meet my child! <laughs> Super dramatic, this is really close, oh my god. Y'all can see my nooks and crannies. But yeah, okay. wait, wait, wait.